he's a hard worker. I mean, that's the great thing about him. He's a, a very humble kid, always been that way. He's very competitive. Uh, all he wants to do is get better and find ways to get better. So his same routine, he's taking the same approach as he did as a true freshman. And you just see him growing and growing and growing on the field and off the field. And just becoming a better football player and the knowledge of the game. So he does great things for us. And then along those same lines, what's it been like as a coach watching Jaden and Mickey go through all he's gone through over the last year and to get to where he's at right now? Yeah, as every corner, it's going to be some adversity. Um, you be out there, that's the, the name of the game out there. Um, so to see him uh, go on a bumpy road and still have the confidence that he does and plays the same way he does, he does. And um, the great thing about it is I have the most confidence in him. Um, to go out there and perform and compete, and that's who he is. He, he has a competitive spirit in him and um, a great mindset in him and how he approaches the game the same way. And then before his injury, what did you kind of see out of Christian Gray with the first couple of weeks? Uh, focus. He was focused. He's just eager to learn, and he's still eager to learn um, during his injury, and that's the great thing about him, right? He doesn't want to fall behind mentally, so what is he doing? He's still getting extra meetings every day, uh, staying involved with it, and just like he was attacking each day out here in the spring and making great strides, now he's going to attack his rehab and make great strides, and he's still um, approaching from the mental side of it as well. Coach, how have they responded um, to kind of the challenges that you've given them this spring? Uh, great. You know, everything I ask of them, uh, they do, and they do more. Um, they want to be great. Each one of them have a, a drive in, the, in themselves to be great. Uh, so that's the great thing about it, where I get to be able to see them uh, grow and compete every day. And then, you know, do extra. You know, that's the biggest thing about it. You just do the minimal, you're just going to be okay. You just roll the ball out. But if you do extra, um, that's where you, you make great strides. And that's what they do. What's the leadership like, whether that's verbally or just, you know, go like, out there and perform? Mm -hmm. Uh, well, it's a great leadership, right? You get you get the best of both worlds. You got a Cam Hart that's uh, been around, played a lot of ball for us. That's very vocal in the room and uh, gets the guys going in that way. And then you got a Clarence Lewis who's played a lot of ball here as well, who's uh, a more action guy that is going to show you how hard he practices every day and how the same approach that he does every day with it. And then you, you see that, and then you get a Ben Morrison and a Jaden Mickey that's younger, but they're growing and becoming mature and, and speaking up as well with it as well. You know, and then it's just like a fire, a wildfire. Well, so. Lorenzo walked over here in a white jersey, I guess. What about his skill set translates to, to corner? Uh, he's very strong, quick. Um, you know, he plays with great effort. You know, he plays fast, diagnosed uh, routes really fast. So that's the things that, you know, you look for in a, a great corner. Obviously, ball skills and things of that nature. So, uh, you know, he's only been over a couple of days, uh, you know, just off and on. So uh, he's doing a good job, you know, what we ask him to do. So continue to grow.